down to an important new warning for parents and their children about online threats after two students at Virginia's George Mason University were blackmailed over explicit videos. Authorities warning this is a growing problem. ABC's Lindsay Davis is here with more details. Good morning, Lindsay. Good morning, Robin. It is graduation week at George Mason University, but for some, celebrations are giving way to concern about this online trend called sextortion after at least two George Mason students were victimized by this crime. The alert was urgent, an email blast warning all George Mason University students of threats of sextortion on campus. To hear that there were not one but two more cases was really disturbing. Police at the Virginia schools say unknown suspects gained the trust of two students over the Internet, enticing them to broadcast sexual acts over their webcams. Once they did, the suspects recorded those videos and later blackmailed the students, threatening to post them on the Internet if they didn't pay $5,000. I think everyone puts their lives on the Internet. I feel like we should back away from that. It's something that the Department of Justice says is becoming all too common, calling it a significant and growing global threat especially when it comes to children, saying in a new report that many victims drop out of school, have declining grades, and in some cases engage in activities to harm themselves, like cutting or even attempting suicide. Sextortion is something Cassidy Wolf, crowned Miss Teen USA in 2013, knows all too well. Congratulations. At just 18 years old, she says she unknowingly clicked on a link that gave her hacker, a former classmate of hers, access to her computer and her webcam, secretly taking nude photos of her before threatening to make the images public. And they watched me in my room for a year without me knowing. They had videos of me changing, getting ready for school. Wolf's hacker was convicted and sentenced to 18 months in federal prison. Now she's hoping to use her voice to help others keep themselves safe. I became aware of how important it is to be safe online, to protect your social media accounts, protect your emails, because if someone were to ever get a hold of any of that, they could basically control your life. Police say if someone you know becomes a victim of sextortion, report it right away and do not pay the money. And of course, they say the best way to protect yourself is to not take these kinds of pictures in the first place.